Hi guys, welcome to Irish Friday Vlogs. Welcome to another video of mine. Just about to head into Daily Man Park, guys. To catch a match, match day vlog. Bohemians take on Drogheda United. Um, big, big game this. Big, big night of football in the League of Ireland. But um, this is huge, this game. The last time they met, they drew 1-1. Bohemians conceded a late goal in that game. Um, they also conceded a late goal in their last game against Derry City so it's been a feature of Bohemians this season conceding late goals and matches something they really really need to sort out because uh, you know it's pretty much why they are on the table to be honest they're four points behind the Drotter going into this one so this is a great opportunity for Bohemians to get a win and go a point behind Drotter and really put themselves in the European uh, frame again in my opinion Drotted for their part, fantastic result last time out, and Sligo fully deserved to win as well. It wasn't a snatch and grab by any means. It was a, a comprehensive victory in which they won 2 1. A late goal for Sligo in that game, obviously, as well. Drotted, maybe unlike Bowles, have been a bit more solid defensively this season as a unit, I think. Um, but like Bowles, they've scored a lot of goals as well. Mark Doyle and Chris Lyons are top scorers in the league, guys, with seven goals each. So. I'm expecting an entertaining game of football tonight, if I'm honest. It's a massive, massive match. It's a must-not-lose, I think, for Bohemians. Um, but I'm going to go for a one-all draw here, guys. I'll see you in Daily Mount Park. And at last, guys, we fans for this one, so can't wait to get in. See you later. <laughs> You're after aging. <laughs> You're aging beautifully. <laughs> Don't worry, no. Sorry. How are you? See you later. Okay, nice. Run. Oh. Are you confident? I like that Pats as well. Like. Easy already.
If you killed if I left Kelly out, that's too easy though. Hi guys, just home from Daily Man Park and finished Bohemians 5, draw of the United nil. And to be honest, it could have been more than 5 nil. Um, it really was hiding Bohemians gave draw it in this game. Um, where do I start? Georgie Kelly with four goals. Unbelievable performance from Georgie. Took his chance as well. Gave uh, Massey and O'Reilly in particular a tough, a tough night of, of it, to be fair. Um, Drotta started off I thought in the game very very slowly and they just couldn't get into the game after that uh, two goals from Georgie Kelly given Bowles a half time lead the goals I'm not going to say were soft they were well taken actually from Bohemians but I thought it was tough one in the first half Bohemians created a lot of chances as well scored two goals but it seemed like they were getting in very, very easy in this game. Now, they were playing lovely free-flowing football, Bohemians themselves, but Trotter just, I don't know what it was. The, the press wasn't right. Um, there were both players picking it up free in good areas. Um, a lot of ball watching. It was just one of those things. I haven't seen Trotter play that bad this season. Second half then was a killer for Trotter to concede a goal from Liam Burt. Um, literally a minute into the second half. That ended it, to be fair. And with games on Monday then... You're thinking to yourself, look, they just have to get out of here and um and um you know get themselves ready for Monday. Bowles though would be delighted with that in the second half, getting those two goals from Burt and Kelly winning five nil, ping the ball around for the last fifteen, twenty minutes, to be honest with you. They'd be delighted with that performance and result because it puts them a point behind Drotten on the table and sets them up nicely for an interesting game with Shamrock Rovers on Monday. Draw to take on their rivals, Dundalk on Monday as well. So it'd be interesting how they react because up to now, they hadn't been beaten well at all. Uh, their biggest defeat was literally by a goal so far this season. Um, it might be just one of those nights for Drotter. They just had a bad night and you, you chalk it down, you move on. But for Bowles, what a fantastic night and what a fantastic performance by them. Great to see fans back, guys, in Daily Man Park as well. And, um, you know, here's here's some uh, <laughs> things you find funny as well. Like, it was, it was, look, it's great to have all that back as well. And uh, obviously the home crowd um, enjoyed that immensely and um yeah i'll leave it there guys uh, like the video subscribe if you're new hit your bell notification button so you don't miss a video and talk to you soon guys see you later